Welcome to Paradise. Today you are joining us in Simpson Bay Beach in the sunny island of St. Martin. Simpson Bay is home of some of our favorite hangouts, including the Buccaneer Beach Bar, the Green Room, and the Atrium Resort, where today we'll be filming our latest test of the Mariner waterproof drone and see if we can turn it into a submarine. Today we're using the pool over at the Atrium Resort to get some better pictures of the Mariner better illustrating its waterproof capabilities, and I think you can see we got some pretty good ones. Somewhere along the way we got the crazy idea that, well, we know the Mariner's waterproof and floats on the water, but what if it was submersible? Can we actually take this thing and flip it upside down and use the propulsion of the propellers to drive it underwater? So, thought we'd give it a try. The first thing we came to realize is that in GPS mode, as soon as you tried to start it, it would immediately stop, the flight controller would shut down. But then we switched it to manual mode, tried it again, and boom, off it went. Took off underwater, and that was it. As you can see, underwater control is a little bit erratic, as all your controls are upside down and backwards, so it's a little bit hard to get used to. But once you practice a little bit, I think uh, even if we adjust some programming and the settings, you guys will have some fun playing around with this. The other thing we were happy to discover is that the waterproof vented cover actually repelled water even at depths of up to three feet. We opened up the Mariner afterwards and there wasn't a drop of water inside. That was great. So anyway, hope you enjoyed. Take care. See you next time.